It was the 14th of October, 1881, and the sky was bright blue and everything was calm. But the fishermen of Eyemouth, a small fishing village on the east coast of Scotland, were watching the barometer fall rapidly. And the fishermen had to decide whether they were going to the fishing grounds or not. After much discussion, they decided that they would sail. If one sailed, they would all sail. They decided to sail with the conviction that they could make it out and back before the storm hit. No sooner had they reached the fishing, the fishing grounds when the storm hit, the storm later to be categorized as a cyclone. By dusk on that fateful day, which came to be known as Black Friday, 19 ships had sunk and 200 sailors, fishermen, had been drowned. Many of them, as they tried to enter the harbour on the way home and being watched, unfortunately, by their families on the cliff side. 70 widows and almost 300 children were left penniless and with no means of support. And Christine's, Christine's family tree was stripped of 10 able-bodied men, amongst whom were her great-grandfather, his brother, their sons and nephews. And so we'd like to dedicate this song, this next song, called The Shoals of Hern, to the fishermen of Eyemouth. With our nets and gear we're faring On the wild and wasteful ocean It's out there on the deep That we harvest our bread shoals of heron. Now the work was hard and the hours were long and the treatment surely took some bearing and I used to sleep standing on me feet and I dream about the shoals of heron. Now you're up on deck Fisherman, and you're learning all about seafaring. That's your education, scraps of navigation. As you hunt the bonny shores of Heron, night and day we're faring. Come winter wave or winter gale, sweating our course, growing up, growing old as we. Show. Sure. 